Check it out. This is my journey into the the river. Oh yes. <laughs> anyway, check it out, guys. So my kayak has fishing rod holders here, right behind me. So I've got myself a little dock demon. Again, it's outfitted with some nice strong line. I'm gonna use this little fishing rod to catch some of the biggest fish. Hopefully here in a little bit. <laughs> we'll see. Hold on, hold on. Uh, there it is, there it is. Okay, you guys see this circle right here? I'm gonna make a video about it, but I found this cool product where um, I buy this thing and then they cut a hole right here and it makes a hatch, okay? This hatch, it allows me to um, put stuff inside of it. It's actually really cool. Also, my kayak has holes in the bottom like this, right here. Those are called sculper holes, okay? What those are for is to allow the water that might get into here to get out. Okay, that's, that's what they're for. It's not gonna allow me to sink. So they're part of the design, guys. It's okay. Get my oar out. Time to go. Just gonna take a nice leisurely path. Float. There's not much current here, as you can see. It's beautiful. This is the river that I live nearby. It's called the Rio Grande. Right now it's not so grand. It's very, very not so grand. I'm right over the deep part. I know you can't see straight down. I can with my um, glasses though. My glasses are polarized. So I can totally look into the water and see stuff. There's some wild birds over there doing stuff. Wild bird things. Yeah, loving it so far. It's so calm just floating here on the river. I'm thinking about all the other fun stuff I'll be able to do with this too. River camping. There's a spot on the back behind me right here. I can put a backpack, I can put a tent put a bunch of stuff really I'm even thinking about making like a floating raft that'll go behind me just to hold my stuff why not I can make just like a big square out of like three liter bottles and make like a PVC like a roof rack type thing that'll just float in the water and carry my things that way when I want to float down the river for example I can just pull it in get my stuff out of my cooler say for example and then yeah just continue my my river run man I love this thing already $20 bought me freedom on the water mind you that this isn't what they usually cost <laughs> it's these are, this is like a $200 model maybe I'm not even sure what model this is. If anybody knows, chime in. But yeah, first time on the water on one of these types of things. So I'm just learning how to use my oar, how to maneuver around. Let's see how deep the water is right here. Not that deep. Still, I wouldn't want to be in it. It's really, really cold. So yeah, let's skip out on that. Really cool.
see if I can find that school of fish. I've always been told it was a school, but people tell me it's called a shoal. Oh, there they are. See them? See the big carps right here? Behold, all the fish right there. See all the water swirling all crazy right there? Look at all these fish. Whoa. They're right below me. I can feel them <laughs> as they swim by. <laughs> They're making all sorts of waves. This is awesome, guys. I can use my left hand to turn to the left slowly. Man, this water is really, really cold. Brr. That's okay. This is awesome. <laughs> yes. I'm very, 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 very happy with my $20 kayak. All right, let's try my luck here. Let's see what I can catch. I don't need both of the oar holders. I just need one. Unsnap my rod holder. Make sure that it's not snagged or anything. See what I can catch, guys. Oh, oh shit, I had one. I think I snagged one. Whoa, oh, I got one. I got something. What is it? <laughs> oh, it's a carp. It's a carpy friend. And as you can see, I didn't catch one. This one, legitimately, guys, I did snag him. So I'm not pulling tight. I'm just kind of holding him there until I can get him onto the kayak. And then I will let him go as gently as possible. Okay? I don't want to hurt him in any way, shape, or form. More than I have. You see how I got him? I went through the gill and pierced him right there. Look, he's free now. This is a very, very pretty fish. Sorry, friend. Tell your friends I said sorry too, okay? There, freedom. Ah, oh, it's cold. This water is so cold. But yeah. Awesomeness. There are predatory fish in here, guys. It's not just carp. It's mainly carp. That's what's left. For some reason, that's what survives in the river after everything, because maybe the predatory fish are smarter. Carp, there's more of them. If you guys know how to like cook carp, oh, there they are. A good recipe for carp to make it taste not so muddy let me know look right here awesome I'd love to know guys leave it in the comments and again there is water in my kayak but that's okay it's not water in my butt 